My precious one, in the sanctuary of our connection, I invite you to release the burden shadowing your soul, the ache of unmet longings, the scars of betrayal, the weariness from striving. Lay them all at the foot of my throne, for in the yielding, healing awaits. Resist the temptation to cling to familiar pain, to shroud your radiance out of fear. Instead, breathe deeply of my liberating truth until it permeates every fiber of your being. You are fearfully and wonderfully made, crowned with glory and honor. No foe's accusations or past regrets can negate the destiny I've authored for you. When the path ahead seems shrouded in uncertainty, quiet your mind and attune your spirit to my whispers. For I am always speaking, always directing your steps, Linger in my presence, soaking in the revelation reserved for those who tarry. Wisdom will illuminate the way forward as you lean into our divine dialogue. In a world pulsating with chaos, anchor your peace in me. Let the cacophony of voices demanding your allegiance fade into oblivion as you center your gaze on my unchanging nature. I am your unshakable foundation, your fortress amid life's storms. No wave of adversity can overtake you as you abide in the safety of my embrace. Should you stumble on this journey, resist the urge to retreat in shame, for there is now no condemnation for those sheltered in my grace. Bring your brokenness, your missteps, your doubts. I will lovingly reshape them into testimonies of redemption. Watch as beauty emerges from the ashes of your struggles, a canvas for my glory to be displayed. As you navigate the complexities of relationships, let your life become a conduit of my compassion. Extend forgiveness freely, remembering the price I paid to pardon you. Sow seeds of kindness, even among thorny encounters, for love alone holds the power to dismantle hostility. Entrust your heart to me, and I will guard it from bitterness, filling it instead with heaven's perfect shalom. When others ridicule your faith or challenge your convictions, resist the temptation to engage in fruitless disputes. Rather, let your transformed life speak volumes, an irrefutable witness to my goodness. Entrust your reputation to me, for I am your shield and your exceedingly great reward. Focus on faithfully running your race, undeterred by the opinions of mere mortals. In seasons of lack, choose gratitude over grumbling. For I am your provider, orchestrating resources from unexpected sources. Resist hoarding your abundance, instead unleashing generosity to a world in need. As you invest in eternal priorities, caring for the vulnerable, proclaiming truth, watch as I open the floodgates of blessing upon your life. For no one can outgive the King of Kings. When dreams tarry and prayers seem met with silence, trust in my impeccable timing. For I am always working behind the scenes, aligning circumstances for your good and my glory. Waiting is never wasted when it's spent in my presence, being molded into a vessel fit for noble purposes. Surrender your timetable and let me astonish you with the intricate beauty of my plans. As global tensions escalate and darkness appears to prevail, remember that I have already secured the victory. Let hope arise within you, unquenchable and effervescent, for I am coming soon to establish my unshakable kingdom, to wipe away every tear and make all things new. Fix your eyes on eternity, storing up treasures that will endure long after this world fades away. When the path narrows and the valley deepens, Remember Calvary's unfathomable sacrifice. For if I would willingly endure the cross's agony for you, how much more will I tenderly lead you through life's darkest nights? Nothing can separate you from the intensity of my love, not death nor life, angels nor demons, present nor future. You are mine, forever engraved on the palms of my hands. Find rest in the assurance of my sovereign care over every facet of your existence. From your first breath to your final earthly moment, I am intricately involved, sustaining you with my life-giving word. 
No force of hell can thwart my purposes for you, as you yield wholeheartedly to my spirit's leading. In times of decision, quiet the clamor of human advice and fix your gaze on my unfailing wisdom. For I will generously supply all you need to navigate the path of holiness. Resist compromise, choosing instead to build your life on the unshakable foundation of my commands. For true freedom is found not in reckless abandon, but in joyful submission to my ways. As the sands of time slip through your fingers, invest your days in that which carries eternal significance. Cultivate a lifestyle of radical generosity, pouring out your time, talents, and treasure to advance my kingdom priorities. Live with urgency, understanding that each sunrise holds divine potential for salvation, restoration, and transformation. When the enemy assails you with doubts and accusations, take up the shield of faith and extinguish his fiery darts with the water of my word. For I have crafted you in my image, infused you with resurrection power, and destined you to walk in unhindered victory. No weapon formed against you can prosper as you abide in the shelter of my love. Should the path I call you to walk require great sacrifice, remember the unspeakable joy set before you in my presence. For earth's fleeting pleasures cannot compare to the eternal weight of glory awaiting my faithful ones. My child, let your life be a fragrant offering a daily pouring out of worship to the one who called you out of darkness and into marvelous light. Seek my face in the secret place, knowing that I am ravished by your beauty and I rejoice over you with singing. In a world intoxicated by counterfeit delights, let your satisfaction be found in me alone. For I am the wellspring of living water, the breath of existence, the very definition of love. Center your affections on things above, storing up imperishable treasures in the place where moth and rust cannot destroy. As the day of my return draws near, live with expectancy and urgency. Let your life be a blazing witness of my grace, a city on a hill that cannot be hidden. Overflow with audacious compassion, extravagant mercy, and contagious joy radiating my goodness to a world groping in darkness. My beloved child, in this very moment I am here with you closer than your own breath. My presence envelops you like a gentle embrace, a sanctuary of perfect peace amidst life's turbulent storms. Though the path ahead may seem shrouded in uncertainty, I whisper to your soul a promise that echoes through eternity. You are never alone, never forsaken. For I have carved your name upon the palms of my hands, a permanent reminder of my unwavering devotion to you. When the weight of the world presses down upon your weary shoulders, remember that I am your strength, your unshakable foundation. I will not allow you to crumble under the burdens you bear. For I have fashioned you with a resilience that surpasses human understanding. In the quiet stillness of your heart, can you sense the whispers of my love, like a soothing melody that calms every fear and soothes every wound? This love is not mere sentiment or fleeting emotion. It is the very essence of who I am, a love so vast and profound that it defies earthly comprehension. And it is this love that I lavish upon you without measure, without condition. When the enemy assails you with lies and accusations, seeking to erode your identity and purpose, cling tightly to the truth of who you are in me. No mistake, no failure, no shortcoming can ever diminish your worth in my eyes. I see you as you truly are, a reflection of my own beauty and goodness. In the midst of life's deserts, when the landscape around you seems barren and devoid of promise, remember that I am the wellspring of living water, ready to refresh and sustain you. Just as I cause streams to flow in the wilderness for my people, so too will I provide for your every need, abundantly and faithfully. Trust in my provision, 
for I delight in bringing forth fruitfulness where the world sees only scarcity. In those moments when doubt threatens to extinguish the flame of your faith, remember the countless ways I have proven myself faithful. Recall the times when I have parted the seas before you, when I have shut the mouths of lions, when I have turned mourning into dancing. These are but a glimpse of the miracles I long to perform in your life, a testament to my boundless power and unfailing love. As you fix your gaze upon me, the author and finisher of your faith, you will find the strength to persevere, to press on towards the high calling I have placed upon your life. For I have not given you a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. Embrace the boldness that comes from knowing you are a child of the King, empowered by the very Spirit that raised Christ from the dead. And in those sacred moments when we commune together, when you pour out your heart before me in raw authenticity, know that I am not a distant, unapproachable deity, but a loving Father who delights in every detail of your life. I cherish your vulnerability, your honesty, your childlike faith. As you walk in obedience to my word and attune your heart to my voice, you will discover a life of unimaginable purpose and fulfillment. Just as I have blessed you abundantly, I ask that you extend that blessing to others, generously sharing the resources I have entrusted to you. For there is no greater joy than being a conduit of my love and provision. Witnessing the transformative power of generosity in action, as you sow generously, I promise to pour out blessings upon you in good measure. Pressed down, shaken together, and running over, remember, my child, that the resources I have given you are not meant to be hoarded or consumed solely for your own benefit. They are a sacred trust, an opportunity to be a source of blessing and provision for others. When you give sacrificially, when you support the work of my faithful servants, you are storing up treasures in heaven, where moth and rust cannot destroy, and where thieves cannot break in and steal. I know the desires of your heart, the dreams and visions that burn within you. Trust that as you seek first my kingdom and my righteousness, I will faithfully provide for your every need. I will open doors of opportunity that no man can shut and I will lead you into a place of fruitfulness and abundance, both spiritually and materially. So let your heart be filled with gratitude and expectation, knowing that I am a good father who delights in giving good gifts to my children. As you align your priorities with mine, as you invest in the advancement of my kingdom, you will experience the joy and fulfillment that comes from living a life of eternal significance. And in those moments when the enemy tries to sow seeds of doubt or discouragement, when he whispers that your giving is in vain or that your sacrifice goes unnoticed, stand firm upon the truth of my word. For I have declared that my gospel will be preached to the ends of the earth and that my kingdom will advance with unstoppable force. Your obedience and generosity are a vital part of that divine plan, a catalyst for the miraculous and a demonstration of my love to a watching world. So give with a cheerful heart, knowing that I am able to make all grace abound to you, so that in all things, at all times, having all that you need, you will abound in every good work. Trust in my faithfulness to multiply your seed sown, to increase the harvest of your righteousness, and to enrich you in every way so that you can be generous on every occasion. As you step out in faith and obedience, I promise to pour out my favor upon you in unprecedented ways. I will open the windows of heaven and unleash blessings that you cannot contain. I will cause even your enemies to be at peace with you, and I will make your name great in the earth as a testament to my goodness and generosity. Remember, my child, that the world is watching, waiting to see the tangible evidence of my love and power in the lives of my people. When you give generously to support the work of my kingdom, you become a living epistle, a compelling witness to the transformative grace of the gospel. Your generosity has the power to soften hearts, to break down barriers, 
and to draw others into a life-changing encounter with my love. So let your light shine before men, that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. Let your generosity be a reflection of my own extravagant love, a love that knows no bounds and holds nothing back. As you give freely and sacrificially, you will experience the profound joy and fulfillment that comes from being a conduit of my blessing and provision. And in those quiet moments when you reflect on the impact of your giving, remember that your investment in my kingdom is not just for this life, but for eternity. Every soul won, every life transformed, every heart touched by the power of the gospel is a precious jewel in your heavenly crown a testament to your faithfulness and obedience. So press on, my beloved child, with a heart full of faith and a spirit of generosity. Trust in my promise that I am able to do immeasurably more than all you could ask or imagine, according to my power that is at work within you. As you give from a place of love and obedience, I will multiply your efforts and use your generosity to accomplish my purposes in the earth. So give with confidence knowing that I am the one who supplies seed to the sower and bread for food. I will continue to supply and increase your store of seed and will enlarge the harvest of your righteousness. You will be enriched in every way so that you can be generous on every occasion, and your generosity will result in thanksgiving to me. Remember, my child, that the world is in desperate need of the hope and healing that only my gospel can provide. Your generosity has the power to unlock doors of opportunity, to equip and empower my servants to reach the lost, to minister to the broken, and to bring light to the darkest corners of the earth. So let your heart be stirred with compassion for those who have yet to experience the transformative power of my love. Let your generosity be a reflection of my own heart, a heart that willingly gave the ultimate sacrifice, so that all may have life and have it abundantly. As you step out in faith and obedience, giving generously to support the work of my kingdom, trust that I will honor your sacrifice and use it for my glory. I will multiply your seed zone, and I will cause your generosity to bear fruit that will last for eternity. And in those moments when the enemy tries to discourage you, when he whispers that your giving is insignificant, or that your sacrifice goes unnoticed, stand firm upon the truth of my word. Remember that I see every act of obedience, every sacrifice made in love, and I will reward you openly. I promise to pour out my blessings upon you in abundance. I will open doors of favor and opportunity, and I will cause even the most impossible situations to work together for your good. Remember, my child, that your generosity is not just an act of obedience, but an act of worship. When you give sacrificially, you are declaring your trust in my provision, your faith in my promises, and your love for my kingdom. Trust in my faithfulness, lean into my love, and watch as I multiply your generosity for my kingdom's sake.